So this is our gully washer. Hail, heavy wind, rain. Man. Yeah, we need a little more rain. I think so, just a little more. All right, it's June 20th. Cutest little things. Okay, so today's vlog, Friday, June 21st. I wanted to try and get out and spray, but I don't think it's gonna happen. First of all, the usual nightmare of getting the uh, quick attach off and getting the uh, sprayer on and then as you could see half of the uh, luckily I clean it with water afterwards but half of the tank came out when I dropped one of the hoses on accident while I was jammed in between the tractor and the tank so I couldn't grab it quick enough to stop it but let's go check out the tank filling up and I'll tell you my plan so the tanks filling up let me show you the radar we got right now it's one of them that here's what happens if I go out and spray, I get a downpour on me. If I park it like what I'm gonna do and postpone it, we won't get any rain. So here's the future radar. It's just one of them that, you know, if I rely on the radar, it'll be sunny the rest of the afternoon. I won't get anything, but these things just, with this heat we've been having, they just pop up and you, the minute you put a tractor out in the field, then, you, then it starts raining on you. So I'm gonna just, uh, I'm going to just hold off, leave it with 200 and some gallons in of water and just sit tight. And then we'll have another three months of rain till the next sunny day. So I'm going to err on the side of caution because it's a pretty big investment. And it's a big job. So I'm going to just leave it with water in the tank ready to go. But let's take a look at the radar and you'll see what I mean. They pop up as they go. So you, it's a no win situation. And that's what it's been like for months now. Peekaboo, anybody see her? There you go. Wonder if she's got a fawn with her in there. They like that tall grass. She might even be laying down. No, she's standing up.
here it comes and I'm just about done it's starting to rain yuck oh yeah haha -ha, mother nature finally got one over on you all I gotta do is get into the Polaris and I'm home dry the temperature dropped about 15 degrees, man. At least 10, like instantly. As soon as this north wind came, I felt it on my back. So I didn't get to spray today, but I got the lawn cut. So that's gonna help Mrs. Capper out because that's usually her half, but good deal, man. Friday night, weekend on. Oh yeah, hot tub in the thunderstorms, here we go. timing it's starting to come down just got to back the Polaris in and I got something done today I even got the pond dam mode which uh, she hasn't done for quite a while because it's been too slippery and I'm gonna tell you I slid down that pond dam about five times maybe six you know, you, if you ain't going just right, you just slide straight down it because it's wet underneath. The, the grass was about a foot tall on the pond dam. On the part she didn't get, but there's some that's two foot tall. Good deal. And the other thing that I got done before the rain, um, another 500 pounds of soybeans heading to Kentucky tomorrow. So I have all the soybeans that I need maybe a little extra although I am gonna mix three brand new bags just in with the whole batch just to be safe but I got these for 16 bucks a bag and they're only from last year so they will I mean they'll get 70 80 percent germination most likely if they were stored well so we're gonna go to Kentucky tomorrow in a dang slop storm more rain for the next four or five days and here it comes perfect timing perfect timing today although if i would have sprayed at noon today it would have had five hours to set up yeah four hours for sure so it would have been it would have been good but you know how that goes okay and that nice patch of clover in the yard you could see i put the deck all the way up because it's really nice and thick that's why we got deer in here every night um, but I cut that with the deck all the way up as opposed to the lawn. It's doing really nice. Okay, Mrs. Capper just called me. She's north of here about 20 miles and she had to pull over. There's heavy hail and it's coming our direction. You know, when I showed the camera that dark area, that was to the north. That's where she's coming from. And we just had a little bit of hail. Oh, here it comes again. We had hail, then it quit, a little bit of rain. Oh, listen to that. Man, I told you, it did get like 15 degrees colder. Ooh. Yeah, we need a little more rain. I think so, just a little more. Yeah, we need a little more rain. I think so. Just a little more. Where's the stop button now?